Hello all you hardcore boxing fans out there, how are you doing? It's Big Porky here. Please keep right in 800 yards and follow the A14. The voice of hardcore boxing. Uh, I'm just on my way home now, we're not even near A1 yet, we're on A11 is it? I don't know, I'm not good at geography, I'll leave all that to Stig, the Stiginator. He's into all this, but uh, Daniel Dubois, is he about to leave Frank Warren? Well, I want to get this video out first, because I think it's about to happen. You might all think I'm crazy and all that. Well, listen to this. I told you Yarde is going to go to Eddie Hearn. No. Well, let me tell you this. Dubois is about to jump ship as well. You might think I'm crazy, well, what can I do about that? I'm not crazy. Let's tell it as I see it. I tell you what, I tell you what, I get to hear off the right people. Now, some people might want me to put stuff out there because they might be in the contract negotiations and they might be, or they might be misinformed or they might just be trying to help their friends out, but, no person that's told me is in the know, I'm not going to say who. I don't have to reveal my sources. Sources. Daddy's source, HB source, nah. Heinz, Heinz for me. But, is the bar about to jump ship? Well, we'll see, won't we? We'll see, watch this, I'm going to send Frank, Frank Smith at Macho, I'm going to burn his head out. Good old Frank Smith at Macho. Is that Richie Rich from Matchroom? How are you doing Richie Rich? A little birdie tells me, or should I say one of my sources, and it's not Daddy's, it's HP actually, tells me that Daniel Dubois might be jumping ship. Now I wonder where he could be jumping to. What do you think to that Richie Rich? <laughs> All right. Keep on trucking, Richie. If it's bull, it's bull in it, but I don't think it is. So he's not bad. Punching above my weight there, aren't I? A bit. Hey, Fiat 500. I usually get them we uh, Ford Fiestas. Blue with a red wing and a green bonnet. <laughs> Kids in tow with pram in, pram on roof rack. I'm only joking. It's been a long day, hasn't it? It's been a long day. We could call we could have called that video earlier looking for Alan Minter. Could have added a fall for that one. I don't know. I got carried away with myself, I think, didn't I? I don't know. Keep me slap me back in line, hasn't it? Yeah, get me in line. Anyway, but like I said, it's not going to be a long video. This it's just uh, It's not going to be a long video, but it's amazing isn't it, what you get to hear in it in boxing industry. Oh my god! Well, that's the big story for today, isn't it? The bar. It'll all be out by the time my videos are out. Bloody hell! Nicholas got a spa session tomorrow. Choose so it'd be Wednesday, won't it? 
be out by then, won't it? If not, but it's what it is, isn't it? So, not very well, to be honest, I feel rough. I'll tell you what, when I think I'm a taxi driver, like Stiggy, hey? All these, you know, all this here, Cambridge, this A1 at Cambridge. Is it A1, A11? M11? Roads are terrible. A14. Huntingdon Road, A14. Roads are terrible. Really, really bad. And barriers in the middle of the road and lot. But, uh, Nicola, Nicola spoke to me earlier. She reckons Eddie Earn's show at weekend were good value, but I don't know. I don't know. But uh, we'll see, won't we? But I hope you're enjoying the video. There's a lot of efforts going in. But like I said, I heard a few people being crybabies over at videos. If you don't like them, don't watch them. Not. You know, I don't want you to be unhappy watching my videos. If you're unhappy, email me porkycorner at mail.com and let me know what you want, what you want to, what sort of videos you want out. My opinion is not going to always agree with yours. Now, I didn't want to put, well, I didn't. I don't do thumbnails, but the Tyson Fury video. That every time there's a Tyson Fury thumbnail or anything to do with Carl Froch. All of you, all start crying like little girls. Let me tell, tell you this, right? When HBO have Carl Froch two, sorry, when Showtime's Al Bernstein's got Froch two and three rounds up against Kessler in Denmark, and he's dropped Kessler, and the referees not give it as a knockdown, but yet the cat, the scorecards are shockers. They give him two rounds, but yet people have got him winning by two or three. And, and, and they haven't given him the knockdown, look, that to me is a robbery, if you don't like it, don't watch it, who cares, alright, so that's just how it is, if you don't like it, I'm not going to be right on everything, what I say is not going to be something that you're always going to agree on, but keep your comments coming, keep them coming, but if you don't like it, what I want you to do, Dislike the video and unsubscribe if you don't like it. That's what that's what you should do, innit? If you don't like something and you think it leaves, you think it's shit, get rid of it because you know shit it leaves stains. All right. But for those people that do like the videos, brilliant. Much respect. But for the people sending in nasty emails and things like that. Uh, God, whatever, I'm gonna burn my houses down, burn my cars and slice my kids up, it's all good fun isn't it, it's all good fun hiding behind a keyboard, I'm not hid behind a keyboard, somebody called me a keyboard warrior, there you go, my face is on camera, there's no keyboard warriors like me, called Big Cali Boxing, <laughs> Big Cali Boxing, oh my god, stop hiding behind your keyboards, send me an email and let's see a photograph of you people, let's see your videos, alright, peace out, keep on trucking, keep supporting boxing, keep supporting Climate Core, and all those people that run up, I want a quote for your aircon. Brilliant, you're making me look fantastic. Keep it coming because that's what it's all about, isn't it? The boxing community. Alright. Shout out to Terry Chop and Diamond's video the other day. We're alright, that episode 9. Keep on trucking, Terry. Keep on trucking. Alright. 